What's up watchers, Will here with another Black Panther video for you, and in the last video we talked about Shuri, but this time we talk about the OG. No, not Bashenga, I'm talking about Papa T'Chaka. In the beginning of Black Panther, we get a pretty good glimpse of young T'Chaka in his Black Panther suit from his tenure as Damisa Starki. What is interesting to note is that a lot of his suits take inspiration from T'Challa's other suits in the comics in terms of the concept art that was made for him. We see versions with the open mask, ones with the gold accent, we see the vest incorporated into it similar to the Man Without Fear run. Some even have a similar design to the original Black Panther costume that has the line gloves and boots added in as another classic touch. We even get the cape in a few of the designs. Each has aspects that make it unique, and it seems like they had a lot of variety compared with what they ended up settling on. Andy Park, one of the artists working under Ryan Maynarding on the film stated, I was trying to come up with a design that was still high tech, but less so than T'Challa's Civil War look. Thus, the visible tactical vest. This was so much fun. When describing the final suit design that they used for the movie. The African wraps on many of the designs were ultimately a decision made by Ryan Coogler as a recommendation for the creative team to include. This may explain why they dropped the cape in the final product, as having a body wrap and a cape may be a little too much and in terms of motion for the character himself, may not make much sense having so much loose fabric all over his body. When the actual suit first appeared in the movie, it quickly became one of my favorite suits, simply due to the gold accents, and I feel like between T'Chaka's suits, the Golden Jaguar habit, and the Civil War costume, somewhere between them all there is a perfect Black Panther costume there. I say if you put the gold accents on the Civil War suit, but smooth it out kind of like the Solo film did in terms of his body, and give him the cape from the designs, you could still kind of finagle yourself a pretty awesome suit. But let me know your thoughts. What do you think of all this fascinating concept art we have of T'Chaka, and how would you craft the ultimate Black Panther habit in terms of design? While you're there, make sure to like and subscribe to our channel, Hybrid Network, and consider checking out our website and Patreon for more content. I'm Will, and I'll see you next time.